Hey everyone, good morning. Um, just some thoughts for you. I was thinking about uh, Matthew chapter 6, 33. Um, actually, you know, that chapter talks about Jesus is saying, you know, don't worry about what you're going to eat. Don't worry about what you're going to wear. Don't worry about the things of the day. Don't worry about your life. And he basically said, don't worry. It's like, wow, okay. H how do you not worry? <clears throat> I realize that even if I worry, worry's a sin. You know, so what chance do I have, man? But, you know, I think about what Jesus said. He said, don't do all this stuff. But then he said, but seek the kingdom of God first. Seek first the kingdom of God and righteousness. Okay, so the word seek there, when you study in the original text, it means to take aim. It means to be all into, to be all about. So he said the priority, and priority speaks of what's number one. He said the priority of what you need to do in your life is, is begin to take aim and be all about the kingdom of God. Think about the kingdom of God as God's way of doing things. Um, and righteousness. You know, I think the body of Christ has heard enough about sin. Okay, sin's an issue and it always will be an issue, but I think he, our focus should be righteousness because I think if our righteousness is focused, um, uh, you know, upon that, you know, I, then I think that the sin issue will take care of itself because Jesus already paid for my sin. He already paid for it. So why should I focus on righteousness and not sin? Well, because when I focus on sin, I'm guilty. I'm guilty. And here's what Here's what the book of John says, um, John 3, 16 and 17. This is, uh, John 3, 16 is a scripture I had to memorize in Sunday school when I was a kid. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son that whoever, you know, would believe in him would not perish but have everlasting life. But you gotta, you gotta take the next verse too. For God did not send his own son into the world to condemn it. Okay, the word condemned there means guilty. So God did not send his own son into the world to call us guilty, to call me guilty, but that through him, through Christ, that's why he's the door. Jesus said, I'm the door, right? That through Christ, um, we might be saved. That word saved there means to be rescued. So all this, all this stuff uh, with God and Jesus and, and the Bible, it's really about rescuing us and set us, setting us up and helping us to understand who we really, really are, but we'll, we're still caught up in Christianity, right? We're still caught up in everything that's not kingdom because we're, you know, some of us are learning and I think some of us don't wanna learn. But I love righteousness because righteousness basically means right with God's government, right with the government. It's not a religious term, it's a governmental term. But you know, it also, um, it, it means to be justified and justified, the, the root word for righteousness basically is innocence, to be innocent. So when God looks at me because of my relationship with Christ, um, he doesn't remember my sin. I, I'm, not, I'm not guilty, it, I'm innocent. And that's a big deal, it's a freeing thing because it's one thing to, to not be accepted by people we all want to be accepted it's another thing when you feel like you're not good enough for God but we are good enough for God because of Jesus and not because of what I've done God accepts me not because of how good and holy I am he accepts me just because he loves me he's not here to call me guilty right so seek first take aim at the kingdom of God so I'm going to put in some more videos out about the kingdom what that means because we have people that has been religious and been in church um forever and we still don't know what the kingdom of God is um, so yeah so anyway hope you have a good day so seek first the kingdom of God seek first make it priority the kingdom that was Jesus's priority the priority of Jesus wasn't even salvation he never even preached a message on salvation he had a conversation with Nicodemus is salvation important of course it's important but it's a product of what the kingdom offers and so we have to seek the kingdom first and then, then he said, once we seek his kingdom and righteousness, then all these other things will be added to us. All these things that we worry about, that we try to get ahead in, that we, you know, trying to just to survive. He said, if we seek the kingdom first, everything else will be added to us. So I know I probably just popped a lot of questions in your head and maybe you offended your theology, but that's okay. Jesus does that all the time. So anyway, I love you guys. Have a great Thursday. Um, yeah, make yourself smile. See ya.